Hey, what's up, everyone? I'm Praetorian, and welcome back to Arts Farm 4s. We are playing with Japan. Uh, so, um, yeah, the war's gonna be starting here. Um, probably right now. I think I'm gonna go ahead and join the war. Uh, we, we are training up these Marines here. Um, and it probably would be best to kind of let them let them go uh, before we, we join. Um, but you know what? It's it's fine if we don't launch the invasion immediately. Uh, we'll, we'll let them train, uh, and it's fine. I want to get into the war. So let's, let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna join their war right now. Um, the German Czechoslovakian War. I accept. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and let that go. Uh, put it down to speed uh, three here, and now we are at war um, with the uh, uh, with all the allies. Uh, Czechoslovakia has already capitulated. I love how they changed all this up, so you, you can see clearly who has already capitulated. Um, just some great changes overall that they made. Already they have lost 321,000. A lot of those are probably Czechoslovakians. Yeah, 112,000. Uh, France has already lost 157 though. Probably throwing all their men against the uh, German defensive lines was pretty stupid. Uh, and then on our side, 43,000. So not bad at all. Uh, looking at our current divisions here. Um, I have almost as many divisions as Germany does. Um, Italy has 116. A lot of those are reserves though. So, you know, it's <laughs> not anything to be super proud of. You can see the allies don't have a ton of divisions though themselves. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, get our order started. Uh, we have a couple um, armies ready to go immediately, um, such as this one. Let's go ahead and get them going now. Uh, and then we have uh, the army down here also ready to, to go. Um, and I believe that is it um, for right now. I don't think there's anybody else ready to, to uh, hop into this war just yet. No. We're going to wait for the Marines um, to finish training. Uh, although we do have the purple army. Yeah, we have the purple guys. Uh, we're going to want to get them... Um, doing something. We might wait. No, I'm not gonna wait for them to train up. It's fine. Um, let's let's go ahead and get on to the. Are, are they are they getting themselves? They're demanding Slovenia right now. Okay. Um, are they going to get themselves a claim against Belgium? Because until they do, there's really not much we can do. I mean, we can come over here and help with Italy, but Italy doesn't seem to need any assistance. You know, we're probably just gonna stay in Berlin uh, for now and just kind of wait for any naval invasions. Because there's really not much I can do. Um, I'm not going to, you know, obviously I'm not going to invade France, you know, on the Maginot Line. That'd be pretty stupid. I don't want to come all the way down here because our main purpose of being here is to save Germany from naval invasion. So being down there would be pretty fucking useless. Um, so yeah, we're going to, we're going to stay where we're at right now. I'm not too worried about it. It looks like Germany's doing okay for now. Um, oh, our Navy. What am I thinking? Uh, let's get the Navy and the Air Force going too. Yeah. Uh, come on, let's, let's do some work, guys. Um, let's get this this navy going first. Uh, they will be doing search and destroy. They're going to be doing the South China Sea. They're going to do the Straits. And, hmm, where do we want to cover? I don't really want to do the Bay of Bengal. I feel like our, uh, our ships are going to get tore up over there. Um, Gulf of Thailand doesn't seem that useful either uh, right now. Um, we could do the Java Sea. Yeah, I guess we'll cover that. Yeah, I'm not really seeing anywhere else, um, that I feel comfortable covering. Uh, yeah, there's no reason really to cover here. Um, there is that port there. Um, but yeah, that doesn't, you know, I don't think we need to do that either. Or we could just leave them just covering those two, uh, and leave it open for, you know, if we find any other better, you know, that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna have them just cover those two for right now. That's okay. Uh, and then, uh, let's go ahead and get the other fleet wherever they are at right here let's go ahead and get them uh covering uh their areas i'm doing some search and destroy uh hopefully they don't get destroyed because it's not a very large fleet i mean it's 50 ships but uh it's definitely not as strong as the other one it's only one carrier uh and then i did already assign the the carrier planes uh so they'll be making their way over there soon uh we are going to cover hmm let's kind of swing in the round here and see where exactly we want to cover i know we want to cover this one so i don't know why I'll just go ahead and add that do we want to do the solomon c though that's that's really what what I'm uh, not sure of. Let me just see where all the uh, the British and, and French islands are. We there is a French island here. There's nobody there though. Oh, no wait, that's American. That's Guam. Never mind. Um, yeah, I think that's. Yeah, I think covering here would probably be the best bet. Yeah, these are all Americans. Okay, so we'll we'll cover over there. Add this one into their uh, Solomon Sea here. All right, excellent. So we got all that covered. Uh, hopefully we'll find some British ships over there, maybe some British convoys, if, if anything. Uh, and then we have our submarines as well, and we have this this fleet here. We're going to go ahead and get them going um, out here uh, to do a search and destroy mission. Why are they already set to search and destroy? Oh, I think that was that original fleet that we had. Uh, they will be covering the Sea of Japan. They'll be covering the East China Sea, and they're going to be covering this region here. We could do the Philippine Sea instead, which might actually result in more combat for them. You know what? Let's do that. Yeah, let's let's have them cover that. Philippine Sea. There we go. 
Uh, so yeah, they're gonna cover all that. Um, and the the uh, submarines. That's the other ones we have left. Just trying to think there. Um, I know that we have them assigned down here, but I don't think they've actually made it here yet because I did like just sent them. Um, it was not that long ago. Yeah, and these guys are joining that fleet. Um, so yeah, here's our two fleets here. Uh, what we have them, we got them going to is we have this guy. He's coming on over here. Uh, we'll go ahead and give him his mission now, which is going to be some convoy raiding. Um, he's going to convoy raid in the Straits, the Bay of Bengal, and probably the South China Sea as well. Yeah, I think that'd be the best bet. So yeah, he's going to cover those areas. Uh, and then the other fleet is going to be assigned over here, um, and he's going to cover this this area here. Convoy raiding. Cover that. Um, do we want to do the Bismarck Sea, or do we want to cover this area? I am worried about all the uh, Australian troops that might be coming through here. Uh, so, yeah, we might want to, but then, yeah, that's not really... I can't get as far as I want to get here. Uh, okay, we'll do the Bismarck Sea, and we'll do that one. It's, it's fine. Um, and, yeah, that looks good. I believe all of our fleets are assigned. Uh, let me just double-check, make sure I'm not... Oops, I click every button but the one I want. Make sure that I got all of them. Yeah, we do have... Uh, yeah, the, all of them are assigned. Awesome. Uh, and then our planes, we want to get them flying overhead as well. Come on, F3 there. Uh, let's get these planes going. Oops, god dang it. I clicked the port. Um, so, hmm... Oh, okay, that's right. I completely forgot. It's all changed now. Uh, let's do air superiority over here. Uh, close air support. Um, and then over here, we're gonna do, um, no, no, what am I doing? Yeah, I'm still learning, guys. I'm still learning the, uh, the naval strike here. Uh, I'm still learning the, uh, how to do all the missions and stuff, uh, how the best way to do them is. Um, hmm. I don't really want to do naval strike there. Like, how do you assign, can you just assign, because, yeah, this is, that's weird. Hmm. Oh, okay, I'm an idiot. All right, I am a dummy. Uh, we want to assign them individually. All right, that makes a lot of sense. Uh, there we go. All right, so that's, that works out better. I'm still getting used to the, the air mechanics because they've changed up and I haven't really had a whole lot of time to uh, make use of them yet. And all, are all these guys assigned to the South China Sea? I thought I assigned some of them to Borneo. Apparently, I did not. All right, well, let's fix that. These guys are assigned to Borneo now. There we go. Um, and yeah, these guys are going to be uh, close air support, uh, air superiority, and naval strike. Um, who else do we have assigned uh, that we need to get going? I thought we had somebody here. Um, hmm. All right. Did they not get there yet? That's weird. Where are our planes here? I thought we had signed some right there, but maybe we didn't. Um, man, I'm just misremember misremembering. Um, I thought we had some here too as well, but I guess we did not. Uh, let's go ahead and get ourselves at least some close air supports. Oops. Not. There we go. Um, Get some close air support going there. Damn it, I messed it all up. Uh, and do we have fighters? Eh, not a lot. All right, let's let's do this. I, I, I figured this is how we're going to do it, guys. We're going to just get 50, 50 over here. There we go. And then, yeah, both of these guys are going to be assigned over here. Uh, and they're going to be doing uh, air superiority and close air support. Uh, and then, um, damn, I, I wish I hadn't forgotten about those, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, we do have naval bombers already assigned over here to the Big Mark C, it seems. Um, so let's go ahead and get, I didn't remember assigning them over there, but yeah, I guess we did. Um, let's go ahead and give them their naval strike mission. Um, yeah, that's the 57. That's right, I do remember that now. We're, we're, that's where all our guys are currently going. Is there any other planes that need to be assigned here? Um, I don't think so. I think we're good to go. Yes. Good to go on the planes, good to go on the navies, uh, and yeah, now we're 10 minutes into the episode, and now we're actually good to go on the war. Uh, I'm just kind of double swinging through here, double checking all this, uh, make sure that we're not doing anything we don't need to be doing. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and let the war roll, guys. Um, so uh, these troops are, are currently invading over here to take all this territory. We did bypass the demand French Indochina because France is already in the war. Um, they can't do that. Why aren't these guys attacking here? Let's, let's go ahead and get this done, guys. Come on. Is this all one province? Yes, it is. Okay. Go ahead and have all these guys attack here then. Uh, and then have these ones here support that attack. Um, they're currently going that way. Um, hmm. You know what? Let's just pull this back. Attack over here. Oh, that's not going to work either. Never mind. Okay, let's pull all these back. These attacks are, are clearly not going to work for us. Uh, this guy's taking on this territory, which is excellent to see. Um, you know, I actually want you to take that port. Uh, because then we're going to have all these guys cut off from supply. 
So that'll be lovely. Uh, and it seems that the National of Spain wants to send us some volunteers, I accept. Um, and it looks like we did have ba battles going here. Uh, one of our submarines, or, or excuse me, we have sunk one of their submarines. Um, our fleet has. Awesome. Um, volunteer forces and transfer. Uh, and it looks like, yeah, that's just... Uh, us shooting down those, those submarines there, or shooting down, excuse me, <laughs> bombing those submarines there. Uh, so we do need to take a look at for our, uh, uh, watch out for any naval battles. Here we're currently battling a battleship and three light cruisers um, over here in, uh, come on, I'm trying to go to the Bay of Bengal here. Um, why is it not like going there? Um, I mean, I can just click over here, but it'd be easier. Uh, and we're trying to sink some convoys here with our submarines. Uh, they do have some destroyers, though, coming after us, so that's not good. Uh, so we might be losing that submarine fleet kind of early. Um, all right, it, it's fine. I don't really care. They're just submarines. They're just submarines. Um, okay, this is a little bit of a naval battle. Something exciting here. Um, and let's just turn this down just a bit you know we can take it up it's fine um and yeah we now have an actual naval battle here uh against a french carrier uh three light cruisers 13 destroyers so this is a rather large uh french fleet here yes it is a very large french fleet okay uh they don't have any planes though they've already been shot down or they never had them i don't know um but yeah this is gonna be a oh it's already ended how unexciting <laughs> that was really unexciting one really uneventful um so we're already invading over here um it's been pretty easy going they don't even have anybody to defend this territory um go ahead and just march in here guys i want you going that way instead uh we did get to subdue the warlords uh which is excellent when does that uh, war goal end okay we have till 1940 so we got quite a while um, and then uh, let's get a national focus going. We're into the war now, uh, which does open up some of the things that we can do here. Um, we can befriend as I am or pressure them. Uh, eventually, we're going to probably be befriend them, right? Um, or does that annex them? I don't really remember um, which one that does, but I think we'd want to, to befriend them. I think it'd probably be the best thing to do. And then improving national spirit is one that I definitely want to get here relatively early, probably now, in fact. Uh, that's probably what we're going to go for now I'm thinking about it. I think that would be the best one. It would be really helpful uh, for us getting that extra political power um, now, early here in the war, uh, so that we can get our... We still need to, to build these guys out. Um, so I think it would be a good idea to get those. Uh, and we did just have a loud-ass fucking motorcycle pass by. That was loud as hell. Uh, bomb some British convoys there. Okay, excellent. I want to swing on back over here to Europe uh, and see what's going on, make sure that the British aren't losing... Or the British, excuse me, the Germans aren't losing to a British invasion. All right, everything looking good here. I don't think we need to do anything else there. Um, we're good. We're good in Europe for right now. We're just going to hold our troops back um, and not not do anything crazy. Uh, the Marines are not done. We can stop them from training. Uh, once their um, their morale gets back up, organization, excuse me, once their organization gets back up, we're going to launch that invasion over there. Uh, these guys are still training. These guys are done as well. Let's go and stop them so that we can launch that invasion over here. Um, and then we do have a naval battle over here. Okay, we're just thinking some, some convoys. Okay, um, what do we got going in the Bismarck Sea? Okay, that's the Bismarck Sea one. East China Sea. Um, see, why is it not going? Oh, okay, you got to click this. I'm not trying to click on that. That makes a lot of sense. I got to click on that. Uh-huh. I'm a dummy. Uh, so, looks like we have caught uh, some French uh, ships out here again. Hopefully, we we'll actually get these ones destroyed. Last time, nothing really happened of that one. Um, and then the Bay of Bengal. Um, we still have our, our submarines out here. We've already lost almost the entire submarine fleet. Um, can we get them retreating, please? Yeah, why don't you guys disengage? Uh, we want you to repair now, get home um, to Sumatra. Come on, get out of there, guys. Get out of there, men. All right, that battle's over. We lost 22 submarines. That's fucking submarine warfare for you. You really can't do shit with them as long as there's fleets out there. Uh, they do a terrible job. They Paradox is just not simulated very well. Uh, the mechanic of... No, we'll take this last, guys. I want all you guys over here. Uh, they haven't really simulated very well the uh, the way that submarines work. Let's go ahead and take all this land. Uh, we're trying to get them cut off. Uh, we've had some difficulty doing that. Apparently we lost over here. All right, well, that's kind of a bit surprising. Um, yeah, we'll support with all these guys. Hopefully we'll win this time. Uh, and when do we get those volunteer forces from Spain? Uh, it's going to be on the 24th of November. I don't know where they're going to uh, pop up. Probably somewhere around here. It's the closest area to Spain. Okay, that's not going to be the closest. Maybe here? One of those ports there? Um, and hopefully they actually do something. Don't just sit there. Uh, not not reacting um, to the war. Uh, we'll just have to see what happens with them. 
And over here, we actually do have one of these Marines done. Let's go and pull him out. Oops, don't want to stop training. I want to pull him out. Uh, we're not going to do anything with him just yet. You know what? Actually, we do have um, another Marine here. Yeah, let's go ahead and, and create a new army with this Marine and this one. Uh, he will be down here in Southeast Asia. He's going to be a Marine unit. And he is going to be the color, not that color. He'll be yellow, I guess. Do we have a yellow for Marines yet? Mm, or purple. He can be purple. All right, uh, so yeah, we're gonna have purple marines over here, uh, and then we need to get them both under a port, and then we'll get them moving um, somewhere. Hopefully they don't get destroyed while moving. Um, and then yeah, we, oh, that's over. Uh, looks like we sunk three convoys over there, did lose a plane in the process though. Um, and then we have a, a invasion, a naval invasion over here. Don't really know, is it right here? Iwo Jima, they're gonna invade I Iwo Jima? That'd be interesting. Where are they going to invade from? Are we covering this with any fleets? I believe we are. I think we're, we're covering it with uh, with one of these fleets here. Where is... Oh, he's covering the Philippine Sea. Hmm. All right, maybe we want to change it up so we'll cover that. I think we do. Uh, so if they want to invade there, that is fine. Who dares win? We got our first ace pilot. Awesome. Um, where are our guys here? Um, why can I not see the thing? Is it because they're currently in battle? I think that's why. Yeah, they're currently in battle. Uh, right now, I think we're gonna have to wait until the battle's done. Uh, I'm trying to select the unit here. We might be able to uh, to change them up here while they're in battle. Okay, we can. All right, you're gonna cover that region now. Uh, make sure that we don't have uh, anybody invade in that area. So we did sink three light cruisers and a British submarine. Awesome. Um, over here, we just bombed some convoys. Uh, and let's take a look at those marines and see how they're doing in organization. They're almost up. Uh, let's just wait though. Uh, we got these guys ready. Where do we want to invade with these ones? Um, I want to keep on taking islands. We already have a red uh, army over here to take these ones um, And let me just see if there's anywhere else where we really want to grab up uh, early on here um, Obviously, we're gonna want to take all this, um, but we're gonna be invading from here uh, So yeah, we're probably gonna wait for that. Uh, we can go and send the Marines over there now though Yeah, let's get the Marines going over here now. They're gonna be invading from from somewhere over here one of those ports all right, so yeah, the war is going, uh, and yeah, it looks like things are going okay so far. Pull those guys out. Uh, let's swing on back over to Europe. Another reason to have this guy in Europe is I can just click that to swing over here real quick. That's nice. Uh, just kind of seeing how things going. Italy is doing fantastic over here. Yeah, they are doing awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look and see what happened on the naval battle. Uh, volunteers are coming to our aid. All right, it looks like they did probably come over here somewhere. Yep, let me just see here. No, maybe not. Hmm, interesting. Not entirely sure where they landed. Where did the Spanish land? All right, yeah, I don't know. Um, maybe that's in, I don't know. I didn't even take a look at where they landed. All right, I mean, it doesn't really, really matter uh, where they landed. Um, just so as long as they go help and do something. Uh, so we did sink a, um, or no, we lost a destroyer um, and four planes, and we sunk 13 French destroyers. Okay. That's not a bad trade at all. I'll trade one destroyer for 13. Uh, and we're just, you know, bombing the uh, convoys as they pass by here. Unread naval battle here as well. We sunk another uh, French destroyer and a light cruiser. Awesome. Uh, and then, yeah, we got a whole bunch of convoy battles here uh, that have been going on. Yeah, because the British are moving troops throughout this area here. Um, and there is a, a, a heavy cruiser there. Uh, it, it seems like their armies are all separated. Uh, what's going on here? Um, Yugoslavia just joined the Allies because uh, Germany has just declared war on All right, Germany, here's Germany doing their thing. Uh, we sunk two more British submarines there. Um, you know, declaring war, stretching out the fucking fronts. Like, Italy's doing well over here, and now they're going to feel the need to pull troops uh, to come over here and deal with Yugoslavia. Uh, Germany doesn't really have anywhere else to attack, so I imagine that's why they did that. Um, but why not attack Belgium and invade France? Like, finish up France first, you know? Uh, we could come over here once again. We're leaving our troops there. I think that's the best thing for us to do right now. Uh, I'm just worried about, like I said, allied invasion. So let's let's keep our troops up there. I'm okay with it. Even though they're not doing anything, it's fine. Uh, it saves us in equipment and manpower, you know. Uh, so we yeah, bombed them over there. Uh, anything else that we need to be aware of? We have still have that naval invasion apparently going to be coming over there. I'd like to see that happen. Uh, why did these submarines come back over here? Oh, I never did. Psh, I'm a dummy. I meant to stop them from <laughs> bombing here. Because clearly this is... Go repair, please. Please repair. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and cancel that if I can. Oh, it's not letting me uh, remove them from that. All right. Uh, it's fine. Let's just put them on hold here. 
and have them go back home. Repair now. Um, yeah, this is <laughs> not... Oh, we're losing all our submarines. Uh, it's it's whatever. Submarines suck. We sunk one more of their submarines. Oh, that's further evidence of submarines sucking. Um, and we did take their port, so they're now cut off from supply, I believe. Uh, that is awesome to see here. Let's go ahead and get them destroyed. Um, maybe. Maybe we'll get them destroyed. We have these troops coming over here, and they're going to be assisting. Uh, they're currently uh, on the fence right now, so they can't do anything just yet. It's okay. And we're just going to take this down to, to speed two right now since so much is happening. I feel like I'm missing stuff uh, because we're just not able to bounce around. We have so many theaters right now. Um, and those are some convoys there. All right. Oh, you can see the convoy strength? Could you see the convoy strength before? I don't remember if you could. I know you can in there, but I mean, could you see it when after the battle? I thought it was just like regular ships you could see. Um, are these guys ready to go? They're still waiting on some equipment. Interesting. All right, well, what about the uh, the red ones? Are they ready? They're still waiting on equipment, too. They're still waiting on some of that support equipment, I guess. All right, um, let me just see what's going on over here. I, I think, I know we have reinforcements as prioritized. I think we're going to put low equipment priorities for all of our, our units here. Probably should have done that from the get-go. Um, and let's just get some more units as well. Uh, a few more Marines here, although we got quite a bit of Marines. We're, we're probably going to need quite a bit, though, so I, I guess it's not a bad idea. Uh, get a few more infantry as well. And get like, you know, get it up like that. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll get five more of these, too. Alright, excellent. Um, and you're not going to build any of this other stuff because they all suck. <laughs> They're all fucking terrible. Uh, so we just got something. Uh, I believe we just got, okay, superior firepower. That's going to increase our troops quite a bit. All right, that is excellent to see. Let's go ahead and keep on moving down this branch here. Uh, we are almost in 1939. However, I want to go ahead and get this. I want to get that organization for the infantry. I think that would be incredibly helpful. I'm not too worried about the lack of equipment for these ones. This is not going to be a, a you know, very difficult battle, or shouldn't be anyways. So I feel okay with sending them. These ones, though, there's going to be some troops here defending. Uh, there might be a lot of troops here defending. I don't know. Um, there's a lot of convoys coming in, so those are Indian convoys, so yeah, there could be quite a few coming in here. Um, so I, I think it would be a good idea. We did sink six convoys here, though. Uh, that's awesome to see. Um, shot down some planes. We lost a lot of planes in the process. Uh, we might want to take a look at how we're doing on plane production for our carriers, since there's a, there's a, they're fighting quite a bit. Um, yeah, as you can see, I would probably don't have enough assigned um, to these yet. Let's go ahead and build up the carrier fighters and the carrier bombers a bit more. Um, and, hmm, let me just see what we can pull from. Is there anything we can pull from? It doesn't look like it. I kind of already pulled from everything that I could. Huh. Naval bombers, no. Close air support are pretty well stockpiled, but, yeah, let's just leave it as is. We'll just have to wait. Uh, we'll have to wait until we get more, more factories. I think we might be building some, but I'm not entirely sure. Um, yeah, we are, but it's going to take a little while to get there. Um, all right. Um, and we did get a free dockyard. I don't know how we got that. It must have took something. Maybe went the land we took here. could be the land that we took over here as well. Uh, let's go ahead and get these uh, assigned to... I'm thinking we definitely need more convoys. Let's do two to convoys. Uh, and then the last one, um, probably to the... I feel like we didn't get enough destroyers built up just yet. Um, so I'm tempted to do... I might do carriers, actually. Yeah, let's do carriers. We'll do destroyers with the next the next uh, dockyard that we get. Definitely need more convoys, though. I don't feel comfortable with our number of convoys. Not at all. Um, you know what? You guys could probably... Um, do we have any assigned over here? We don't. And it's fine. We'll, we'll take that last. I'm not, I'm not too concerned about it. Um, I don't know why they're moving around so weird, though. The in independent state of Karosha has declared war on Yugoslavia. What the fuck? What happened there? That is weird. Let me just swing over here and see what the hell is going on. Um, are they... Okay, they're fascist. Hmm. Is that part of an event or something? Or part of the national focus? That's weird. Alright, I don't even know how that happened. But they appear not to be in a faction. They are fascist. And they are at war at Yugoslavia. Maybe they'll join our faction. Um, yeah, so we'll have Croatians in our faction. Though. That's pretty cool. I don't think I recall seeing that before. I'm a-okay with that. Um, let's go ahead and put... These guys over here. We have another marine unit over here. We can get another little marine army uh, built up uh, and sent off. Um, off to go help out in invasions. They did land somebody there. All right, that's a bit surprising. Yeah, I am like really surprised by that. Um, we're gonna uh, go ahead and assign a full hundred here just temporarily uh, and get them uh, flying and doing a naval strike because uh, it looks like we're gonna lose that. Um, 
God, I did not expect, I expected our fleet to get over here, but it seems like they, where is that fleet? Where's that fleet right now? I should be over here helping out. I get over here and fucking fight, man. Yeah, that, I don't think they're in a battle or anything. And why are these, these submarines not running? <laughs> like, I told them to go. I told you guys to get out of there. Yeah, and they don't have a task or anything. I think I don't understand. Like, get out of there, guys. Stop dying. I'm just losing submarines. Um, we do have something going on over here. Sinking more convoys. Um, but yeah, that's that's strange. Like, where's my troops here? Or my, my, my ships? I don't know. Um, I did not expect them to actually get in through my... Um, yeah, I didn't expect them to get in here. Not at all. Uh, unread naval. Um, looks like we have... Uh, submarines that got sunk, two of them. Yeah, we knew about that. And they did join the Axis. So Croatia is now part of the Axis. That's pretty cool. Did we want them doing a naval invasion? Or do we want them do, helping out in this battle? I'm actually not sure how the best way to do this is. Let's just do close air support and uh, naval strike to make sure they're helping. All right, so yeah, that would be crazy if we lost that. I mean, we can easily take it back, but it's really not the fucking point, man. It's not the point. Um, we can't have them that close to Japan. Where'd they launch from? Like, that's where I'm wondering, like, huh, that is really interesting. I have no idea where they even launched from. Uh, we got our guys currently coming to take this, though, so, I mean, we'll exchange an island for an island, but they obviously got a much better island. Um, and it looks like, uh, yeah, they are now called into the war. Okay, got it. Uh, so those wars probably just combined. I think that's what that other message is about. Um, we could get this, but I think... We should focus on getting something for the Navy right now, uh, getting our chief of Navy. This is really important, getting this this uh, naval uh, war um, uh, victory. Uh, we need a victory here. So we could get naval air attacks from carriers boosted up because we are kind of a carrier uh, fleet here. Um, could also just do the uh, getting the, the attack and the armor um, for the screens or for the capital ships and then get uh, defense for the screens. Um, yeah, I, I'm kind of torn between this because... Um, this one would be incredibly helpful, but this helps all of our ships. Um, it even helps carriers because they're considered part of the capitals. That helps you keep the carriers, uh, keeps them from getting destroyed. So I think that's what we're going to do. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. Um, you know, I, I, I know that we're really more of a, uh, a carrier-based navy, um, but I think it would be a good idea to get that because it helps the entire fleet. Uh, it helps them avoid, help avoid losing ships, which is really important. Um, so these guys should start getting... Um, some help here soon. When do they get here? They're getting here on the 10th of December. I don't know if the, they'll last that long. And I don't know why our fleet is not over here fucking sinking them. Well, they're busy. Okay, that makes sense. Um, but I'm really hoping they get over there. I almost want to like... You know what? I think we are going to do that. Yep. I feel like we have to. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to unassign them from this, this area for right now. Um, I need them over here uh, fighting. Um, over here we have sunk some more convoys. Or we didn't sink them, excuse me. Did some, some uh, damage to them. Um, and then, what do we got going over here? You guys can go take that, I'm fine with that. Uh, well, no, actually, no, no. Wait. Just come on over here. Oops, whoa, 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 god damn it. <sighs> come on. I'm like, why is, yeah, this is annoying. I just pushed, I had all of our troops gone there, if you're wondering what I just did. Okay, so this is where the Spanish are. Uh, they're actually helping out. Well, that's kind of crazy, I wasn't expecting that at all. Nope. Uh, you guys coming over here? Um, you guys can come. You guys can take that. Be over there. Why the fuck is it selecting all these troops? Like, I'm not telling you to do that. That's weird. Did they change the hotkeys up at all? I'm not entirely sure. There we go. Right? Yeah. Okay. So now they're they're working here. Okay. Um, or maybe I'm just an idiot. That's also a possibility. <laughs> That's definitely a possibility. Um, it's been a while since I played, so I could just be forgetting uh, some of the hotkeys. That's always a possibility. Um, so let's go ahead and support with this attack here. Get them all into one province here. Or you know what we could do? Uh, we could pull this back and then just go ahead and attack that province now. Get to working on them. Uh, let's see what happened over here. Um, yeah, nothing. Looks like they did some battle to us, or did some damage to us, which is unfortunate. Um, we might want to get some fighters over here. I, well, we need this, this, uh, can we build in this yet? That's what I'm wondering. It looks like we can. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. Um, I want to build up the air base here, uh, cause it's, it's in a better position for, for attacking over here. Um, I think it is anyway. Let me just double check on that. Yeah, I believe it is. I think it's somewhere right here. I could be fucking completely misremembering here. Uh, but let's build that air base up just a little bit. So we can get some more, uh, planes over here. Um, yeah, that, that'll be fine. 
Uh, and then yeah, we need some fighter support over here, but I don't think they would be able to reach. Uh, and I don't even know if we have enough enough fighters to do to do it. Um, but I think it would be worth trying, uh, since this seems to be where the battle's at. Um, let's. Well, we have fighters here in Borneo, so I'm not gonna move any more. We'll just once we take Borneo over, we'll move those ones. We will get another detachment of fighters over here if we have it available here. Um, not quite. What we'll do? We'll just do 50, and then assign them over there to the South China Sea. Uh, they're gonna be doing. Oh, there we go. Um, let's get them going. Doing the air superiority. Uh, and hopefully they can help shoot down some of those, those planes that are attacking our... I don't know what the range is going to be. Probably, like, right here. So it's not really helpful for here. Uh, that might be one of our blind spots, actually. Uh, we'll just have to see how that ends up working out here. Uh, it looks like we did distinct those four convoys there, which is nice. Um, and I want to see if we lost this island yet. Not yet. And we do have planes helping us out now. Um, okay, that's awesome. We have some planes assisting us, uh, but I, what I need is I need this fleet to come assist us. They keep uh, attacking that battle cruiser and not destroying them, uh, which I'd be fine with them attacking if they're winning. Um, and we did finish up this attack here. Let's go ahead and delete this. Don't need it any longer. And give them a new uh, naval invasion um, to attack um, right here. All right, and that's going to take them, probably won't take them very long, 14 days. Uh, and then uh, we have these guys too. We're going to wait until they get this, this taken here. Um, and then you guys are gonna go this way. Uh, these guys just always make things more difficult than it needs to be. Um, just doesn't make any goddamn sense. Um, go this way instead, please. Uh, and then, uh, are we done over here yet? Not yet. Almost have it finished up, though. Almost. Let's take a look at our purple troops, see if there's anything they need to be doing over here. Uh, nope. Not really anything to be concerned about. There is an invasion over here. Okay. We have some work to do. Uh, let's see if the Polish will let us into their territory. No, they won't. All right. Well, never mind. We're not going over there. Yeah, there's no way for us to get there right now. All right. That's fine. Whatever. Um, can't help out. Uh, because I'm not going to go through the seas, obviously. That'd be really, really stupid. Um, so we, we're currently battling some light cruisers here. Okay. Um, I don't think we actually got any of them destroyed, unfortunately. Is that battle still raging? It seems it is. And there's more ships here. Um, a few more. Ooh, a carrier. Ah, I wish we could get some some big ships destroyed. That would be nice. Um, thus far, we've not had any success with that. All right, so yeah, we are getting some some sport here, and they're doing damage. It's the only thing really keeping us into this battle right now. But it still looks like it's going to be a loss if we can't get our fleet over there uh, to come destroy these guys. Um, they're still in the the sea here. So what we could also do is just put them over here. Um, that's a possibility too, and just let them support that attack. Um, if it become if it comes down to it, if we can't get them destroyed, then that might be what we want to do. Um, okay, so we're we're still attacking over here. Uh, almost have this wrapped up here, um, and having having the Spanish over here helping was nice. It seems like it was only one division. And I know they sent us two. I think they sent two anyway. I don't know where the other one went. Oh, we never sent our Marines. Dee -dee -dee. Um, let's go ahead and do that. We get the Marines sent. Uh, the submarines are just gonna hang out here for right now. Um, we do have a battle going over here with that fleet that I think that was the same fleet that was tearing up our, our uh, submarines. Uh, they actually have a lot of planes over here assisting. That's uh, a little bit concerning. Um, but we do have um, quite a lot much larger fleet than they do. Uh, and this is yeah they just have a carrier battleship, two destroyers and or wait a minute what was that? Oh okay three destroyers total. All right um, hopefully win that don't lose too many ships. Um, obviously don't. I don't want to lose any ships there. Uh, what do we have going over here? It looks like we're fighting a heavy cruiser. Um, I don't want you fighting heavy cruisers. I want you fighting them. Fight them. Fight them. <laughs> so I kind of feel like we might have to tell them to move over here. Um, it feels like there's not going to be any other option. Yeah, I think we're going to have to to tell them to, to come over here. Because I, I'll give them a little bit of a chance to engage them. I, I know they're on search and destroy, but they should still engage convoys. Um... I really don't want to have to take that island back. I mean, it's not going to be a huge problem. We can do it. I just don't want to. To have to. It'd be a pain. Um, so, yeah, let's let's go and tell them to hold and just come on over here. And I don't know. At the very least, I don't think they'll actually attack them. But at the very least, what they'll do is they'll, uh, they'll give us an assist uh, bonus here. So that'll help. Um, what we could do as well is get these guys assigned here um, to this uh, area. And doing naval strike, and I suppose air superiority, right? Yeah, I'll do naval strike and air superiority uh, to kind of help out. Anything that will, any way to help win this fucking battle, man. 
And yeah, it does look like this is this is helping us on. Plus, we got the airship already bonus there, uh, which is nice. Um, but it's still ticking down. We're still losing there. But at least we can make them pay, uh, pay for that. Because remember, this unit gets destroyed. Um, although we might be able to evacuate them, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to evacuate them. I'm a, they're going to fight to the last man. We're doing this a Japanese style. Um, over here, we did get our convoys bombed, unfortunately, but it's okay because we've landed and we, we got all our troops in here. Um, let's go ahead and give them a order. Uh, they're going to be taking all this territory here. All right, um, and they're going to execute that immediately. Attack! Oh, and of course, they're all going to go the same direction. I had to micromanage this shit. Oh, you f idiots. <laughs> uh, that's super efficient, guys. Super efficient. All go to the same province. <laughs> uh, they sent one one lone ranger over here. He did his own thing. He was the only one thinking for himself. All right, yeah, we want to go ahead and get those guys assigned in there. I'm um, still not seeing anything for us to really assist with as of right now. I mean, we could, like I said, we could come down there, but I don't want to go down the south. Um, yeah, we're going to stay in the north. Over here, we have uh, battled against two destroyers. Um, attempting to sink some stuff here. God, hopefully we get that destroyed soon. Uh, we have not had any uh, success with destroying any of their, their large ships yet, um, which is always frustrating. Uh, and then, are these guys ready yet to go? 9 of 14 days. Okay. Uh, still going to be a little while. And that is actually the end of the episode as well. What we'll do here, um, we'll get those guys cut off from supply. Uh, they will be soon once they lose that, that port. And then these guys are going to go over this way. Um, and you can go. You can go that way. I don't care how you get there. It's fine, no matter which way you decide to take. Uh, and then the Marines here. Um, well, we still have ships over here. Uh, I'm tempted to, to naval invade that one um, and then go from there over to here. Uh, and that might be what... You know what? Actually, we can just march all the way through here. I don't know what I'm thinking. Yeah, we'll bring these guys... We'll bring the regular troops over here to take this. Um, we will do a naval invasion. Uh, for this, but I would prefer to do it from right here. It's closer. So we'll wait. Uh, we'll actually just send those Marines over there now. Then go assist. Uh, they need a general, though. Uh, and then we're going to end this episode here, guys. Very exciting so far. Um, yeah, always really exciting when you're in these battles. Um, yeah, we're going to give him. Oh, well, we could. I don't know. I'm you know, getting, being stingy with my level threes here. Uh, it's not like we have any other armies right now. We can always move them uh, if need be. Um, just kind of seeing if any of these guys are currently trained up yet. Not yet. Okay, um, so yeah, that's going well. This one is just about done here. I believe everybody should be assigned to this. Let's go ahead and give them a line um, to take all that, and they're gonna, we're going to have them execute it as well. So they can just go over there and start getting that done. Taking the rest of this over over here, um, very helpful. A lot of resources, 18 more oil, 17 more rubber. Um, really the key, though, is getting control of this state here, the state of Singapore. Um, definitely want to get this uh, conquered and taken over. That's a lot of resources. Uh, that's really going to hurt the Allied uh, war effort. Um, taking this as well uh, is kind of big because, you know, it's, you know, the Australians getting them taken out from here. I don't mean, they might have they might have something built here, probably not. Um, I don't think there's, I, there might be some factories here. I, I'm not sure. I think there might might be one there. I don't really know. Uh, but uh, the key here is just getting them so they don't have any other areas here so we can do a naval invasion. I want to get Australia out of the war as early as possible. Um, they always stick around. AI Japan never, well, AI, AI Japan never actually does any of this. They don't take any of this, this out. AI Japan doesn't do very well. Uh, they usually do pretty shoddy overall. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and end the episode here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, it's always fun getting getting into the war here. Uh, always a, a blast. Uh, just taking a look at their, their navy here. It uh, looks like they have lost a lot of ships, 145 to 189. Uh, 40 to 49, the French have lost quite a few ships as well. Uh, Italy has lost their entire navy, though, so, pff, you know. It's irrelevant. <laughs> Germany also has lost a little bit of navy that they had. So it looks like we are the uh, naval effort of the the Axis. That's that's all there is. Uh, just us. Um, so it's going to be up to us to defeat the British and the French in the seas. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please leave a like. Consider subscribing to the channel. And thanks for watching, guys.